Welcome back to and this guides in today's video we are going to show you how to fix hyping on discord let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time on discord I need you to click the register option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go a high ping on discord can be very frustrating it happened to me a lot especially if i'm a middle of a gaming session or an important conversation with my clients with my boss with my colleagues with partner in the company that i am working right now it is really is annoying right but you have to realize hyping can cause delays auto dropouts and video lag making conversations less clear and of course um it ensures uh, unreliable communication because low ping helps maintain real-time interactions which is crucial for activities like what I do most gaming where timing and coordination are key high ping can lead to significant lag in games impacting your performance and enjoyment by reducing ping you can achieve more responsive and synchronized gameplay now depending on the uh, device that you're using if you're using the uh, discord on the web browser on the desktop application or even on a mobile device i need you to click on the uh, car gear icon the user settings at the bottom left now from here i need you to click on the voice and video under app settings now from here i need you to hover down below where you can find the hardware acceleration all right because this section right here says Hardware acceleration uses your GPU for efficient video encoding and decoding, if available. It means if your machine is not capable of handling um, a lot of um, tasks, basically you have to switch it off, all right? Because it co it could cause lag and of course um, can ensure to give you a high ping, all right? After that, make sure in terms of the uh, quality of service if you enable quality of service high packet priority it says hints to your router than the packets discord is transmitting or higher priority some routers or internet service providers may misbehave that means high ping increases the risks of disconnections and interruptions which can be disruptive during important conversations or gameplay sessions all right so i need you to slide it off it's that applicable to make sure that that these are not the one um, causing the issue after that you see there's going to be an audio subsystem but it's not going to make an uh, you know a big impact instead i need you to click on the uh, advanced setting here click on that you see there's going to be another option that says if you turn on hardware acceleration which uses your gpu to make discord smoother you need to turn this off if you're experiencing frame drops this is very crucial because lower ping provides a more stable and reliable connection reducing the likelihood of unexpected issues or disruption for example if you click on ok the desktop application will restart on its own of course adjusting to the high ping after that the next option that you can explore if you're still experiencing high ping you must check your internet connection use a service like speed test to check your download and upload speeds because low speeds or high latency can impact your discord performance now if you are on wi-fi especially if you're using the tablet your desktop switching to a wired connection ethernet is usually more stable and less susceptible to interference and of course sometimes simply restarting your router can improve your connection all right now after that if you are using a vpn or proxies i suggest you temporarily disable these services if your ping is high due to the routing issues with your vpn of course um disabling it temporarily might help choose a server location close to the discord server you are connecting to all right now after that the next option that you could explore is similarly to your vpn you might want to ensure that your firewall <laughs> excuse me sorry for that are is not blocking or throttling discord now you need to add discord to your um firewall settings to the exception list try to restart to see if that works alternatively 
You can also do the same thing with your far, um, antivirus. I'm using malware bytes. Basically, um, it's one of my trusted software, uh, antivirus software. But again, if this could be uh, the one blocking or th throttling Discord, you might want to add Discord to your antivirus exception list and to see if that works, all right? Because it happened to me in the past. Now, another, another option that you can explore is you can simply go to the Discord server status. Sometimes the problem might be on the Discord's end. You can simply go to a Discord server status and you can check the status page to see if there are any ongoing issues. You also have an option to subscribe to updates to make sure that you are notified in case there's going to be a problem. All right. So right now, like last July 29th, there was an issue with a session starts so you see it's updated um religiously all right now after that the next option that you could do is you want to make sure that you have updated your network drivers to ensure they are compatible with your current hardware and operating system because of course that could potentially lead to high ping and performance issues within your discord app discord browser okay now, the next thing is ensure that you have the latest version of Discord because updates often include performance improvements and bug fixes. But of course, you might want to check the minimum system requirements for Discord. For example, you've um, switched to a different computer or device and it's not uh, capable of handling Discord. All right. So these are going to be the desktop minimum requirements for Windows, Mac and Linux. All right. For mobile. For Android, Android 7 Plus. For iOS, iOS 14. It's going to be very helpful. All right. Now, after that, the next thing that you can explore is you see if there's a chat bot at the bottom right, and you just click on the help and type in your question, and let's see if you get an answer. You see? And then after that, just uh, hover to the topics that you can uh, check to see if there's an answer. Or, if you have tried everything and still have issues, you might want to consider reaching out to Discord support for further assistance. All right. Now here you have like other ways to find help by Twitter and developer support. Now you might want to type in your questions to see if you get an answer. All right. That's that. You can click on submit a request. And of course, just choose the topic. And that's going to be the Discord function, right? After that, one of the support staff will give you an answer after submitting a request, giving you an insights and troubleshooting steps on how to finally fix the Discord high ping. And by following these steps, you should be able to diagnose and hopefully fix the high ping issues you are experiencing on Discord. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.